my friends! Today we will be talking about how to successfully purchase cosplay off of AliExpress. If you are new to my channel, welcome! If you are not new to my channel, you know that I purchase 99% of my cosplay. And if you read the captions in my cosplay tutorials or check the description bar, you know that my go-to resource for affordable cosplay items is none other than AliExpress. AliExpress is a wholesale online retail shop owned by the company Alibaba. The company is based in China and offers competitive prices on a variety of goods. Now there is some speculation regarding the legitimacy and safety of shopping on AliExpress. Personally, I found that a lot of bad reviews and horror stories were from people who were trying to buy things like designer sportswear or laptops, items you're probably best off with purchasing from another source for a really low price. As an online shopper, it is your responsibility to keep yourself safe and use common sense. Out of the 13 orders I've placed on AliExpress this year, I have only had problems with one of them. Here's what happened. I was trying to buy the Attack on Titan 3DM harness for my Annie cosplay. Once I placed the order, it was quickly processed. Then a few days later, I received an email stating that the order had shipped. A couple days after that, I received another email. This time it was from the seller, apologizing because apparently the item I ordered was sold out. Long story short, despite being completely confused by this, I was able to sort out the issue with the seller and get a refund. So without further ado, here are my tips to having a successful shopping experience on AliExpress. Start off by putting in the item you are looking for in the search bar. Now initially there may be an overwhelming amount of search results, but don't get flustered. Filter the search results by showing only top rated items. Websites such as AliExpress thrive on positive customer feedback because positive customer feedback leads to more sales. If you notice that the item you are looking for has multiple listings and you're not sure which one is the most reliable, refer to the feedback and orders count on the side of each listing. The higher the numbers, the more popular and trustworthy the seller is. I also suggest looking through the comments on the feedback section to see what other people have to say about the item and their experience as a whole. Now let's say the item you are looking for isn't considered top rated or doesn't have a lot of feedback. Find the name of the seller located in the middle of the listing. If you notice any diamonds or ribbons surrounding the name, these icons represent major achievements such as having a high feedback score and positive feedback percentage. You can also click the name and it will redirect you to the page of the seller. Once you're here, click the feedback tab located on the bottom of the store's banner. Here you can see the seller feedback which includes a breakdown of the seller's overall performance as well as how much positive and negative feedback they've received over a given period of time. Here's a few more tips! If you have a question about the item you're looking at, you can contact the seller directly at any time. Prioritize a trustworthy seller over finding the cheapest listing of the item you're looking for. Personally, I'd rather pay a little more for an item that I know will look just like the picture when I get it than take a chance on an item that claims to be the same but for a fraction of the price. Once your item has shipped, wait until you've received the item in the mail before clicking Confirm Goods Received located in the My Orders menu. By clicking this button, you are finalizing the transaction and allowing the seller to receive the money made from the sale. If you click Confirm Goods Received before actually receiving the goods, you could potentially be setting yourself up for failure. In some cases, you may not even receive the item or in the event that you are unhappy with the item and would like to exchange it or get a refund, the seller may or may not be compliant. Because confirm goods received means that not only did I receive the item, but I'm happy with it. So with that said, if you receive the item and you're not happy with it for whatever reason, contact the seller first to see what you can do to resolve the issue. Like I said before, AliExpress thrives on positive customer feedback. So the sellers are willing to help you. However, once you confirm goods received, it's kinda out of their hands. 
So with that said, let's say the cosplay you ordered doesn't quite fit you properly. You're better off taking it to your local tailor than shipping it all the way back to China, which, by the way, you have to pay the shipping fee for. And finally, please be safe while online shopping. No matter what website you go on, if you don't feel comfortable about it, you're better off playing it safe and shopping somewhere else. Thank you guys so much for watching. I really hope that I've been able to help those who are curious or weary about shopping for cosplay on AliExpress. Please give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it and found it helpful. And subscribe to my channel, Tara For Your Wellness, for more videos like this and other fun things. Take care and stay well.